In Walker Schools, we have 20 facilities, 16 of which are schools, a planetarium, and then three central service sites. We have about 9,300 students. Um, we have about 1,500 employees. I have to make it to where a kid that hadn't had all the greatest opportunities will have every opportunity afforded to them. Approximately two and a half years ago, we had a tornado come through and take the top off of the building here at the uh, planetary, which ruined all of our equipment that we had at that time. The priorities are to get the network back up and going and to be able to not, not only have it up and going, but to be able to sustain it and to provide growth opportunities to get to that next level. We looked at WatchGuard, Cisco, SonicWall, and many more. The WatchGuard one hands down. Our partnership with Mike Collins Associates started when we bought the XTM 1050. For Walker Schools, the, the, the value is you, you get a lot of bang for your buck on this machine. You look at the other manufacturers, you've got to buy a piece for this. You've got to buy a VPN piece. You've got to buy an SSL piece. So you've got four and five devices that you've got to purchase to get the one solution you can get in the WatchGuard box. The tech support behind the, the, the box is unbelievable. The WatchGuard is smarter than our previous technology. It knows when, what to filter and when to do it. I have to be ready and available to go at a moment's notice and be able to serve a student with a laptop, an iPad, and an iPhone all hitting my network with possibly 90 different products in each classroom hitting the Wi-Fi at the same time. Some of our points of proof of concept have been that our virus outbreaks have gone down, our teachers reporting that kids are on you know, X website, whatever you want to input here, is they have just decreased since all the kids are staying on the ball with what they're supposed to be doing in the classroom. Our testing scores have gone up. We've had some of our highest testing scores this last year that we've ever had. I'm buying technologies as a tool for student learning. Um, and, and in the business world, you'd be buying technology for pro productivity. Um, so it's the same, really. You're wanting your students to produce and you're wanting your business to produce. And what can you do to make that the best experience possible? Um, that's what I think we're doing.